Is it my imagination that all the portions got smaller? No, I think they have, have got a bit smaller, but that's not a bad thing. There are four courses. Mm -hmm. And there'll be veg and bread and lots of booze. I think it's quite enough. Very unusual combination here for me. You know, I, I, I can't make up my mind whether they're all working for it or against it. It's like a bit of an arranged marriage that isn't working. You know what, I mean? <laughs> what I think he's done is he's, he's not gone for any flavours that are likely to upset anybody. They're very safe flavours, mushroom, asparagus, yeah. cheese. Um, for me, they're just too many. The flavour of the asparagus doesn't survive. You can't taste it through the mushrooms and the cheese. Somehow, it doesn't just all pull together. It does, yeah, I think it's from... It's, it's sort of a little bit frayed around the edges. It is too many notes. Too many notes. Too many notes. Too many notes. I'd like my Norfolk asparagus dish to go through because I think it's really seasonal. We've got really good Norfolk asparagus and it's really going to sing. Early summer mushrooms, wild mushrooms. It's going to really work. They're getting them at their best now. Really are at their best. So this should take it on to another level. I'm giving it. I'm afraid I agree with you, Oliver. I have given it five. I have been extraordinarily generous and um, what are the six? Well, the chefs don't know what the judges are saying, but the returning eye. plates sometimes tell a story. Well, not too bad, someone didn't eat that. What's the matter with that? Right, guys, how about a flutter, yeah? 20 quid. That's, that's, my, <laughs> that's my contender, that one. Huh? I think it's yeah. right. contender. Well, a wide range of scores so far, and a surprising result for Michael. But who'll be going forward to the public vote is anyone's guess, as there are still some heavy hitters to come. We'll only find out at the end when the judges announce their top three favourite starters. Then it'll be up to you to call and vote for the chef you think should be cooking his starter for the Queen. So get your pens ready. The phone numbers are coming up soon. Onwards then to the next two starters. Not even a head chef yet, Bryn Williams beat Gordon Ramsay's protégé Angela Hartnett to represent Wales. I'm just a poor Welsh boy who works in the kitchen, so it's quite a daunting experience being in the same company as these boys here. Yeah. He's now cooking against another Ramsay-trained chef, Marcus Waring, from the north of England. I feel a bit hard done by you. Why not? Angela first, now you. <laughs> Taken over by the Ramsay, Ramsay yeah, mob. It's <laughs> a bit of mafia or something involved here, I think. No. For his starter, Bryn serving glazed Welsh goat's cheese and beetroot, with a salad of mountain herbs, pine nuts and beetroot dressing. Bryn hails from Denby in North Wales. I'd say one of the best places in the world myself. You always feel every day happy to be alive. Yes, sir. And seeing all the food around you, because you, as a kid, you just go fishing, cook in the afternoon, so everything's on your doorstep. It was great. Ever the patriot, Bryn's using Welsh ingredients at every opportunity. Now, have you changed your recipe at all today? Nothing, nothing whatsoever. No? I'm quite happy with it. I think the ingredients as it is, it's beautiful, mm. just being together, should be good. Marcus, though, just loves sowing seeds of doubt. They've been knocking ghost cheese quite a lot, though. Yeah, they've, not, they've been fan of ghost cheese, have they? Marcus quickly pointed yeah, out. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> but there's no time to worry, because it's time to plate up. Do you realise if they're not caught, you're going to get slated? <laughs> Stop laughing! Thanks, really? Marcus. It's yeah. true. No, Come it's on. true. Are they done? Yeah, yeah, they're done. They're Tell right. the truth. No, they're done, they're done, they're done. Stop winding him up, they're <laughs> absolutely perfect. Where are they going?